Morgan Merriman, Realtor at REMAX Alliance here in Fort Collins. And thanks for tuning in to another episode of Lifestyle Living's Community Connection. So today I have the pleasure of speaking with Candace Niebling and Jessica O'Keefe. And they are the owners of Wild Bliss Photography as well as Evoke Noco, which is where we're at right now, which is their photography studio and event space. So welcome guys. Thank, Thank you. you. I appreciate you taking the time out of your busy schedule to do this. Absolutely. Thanks for having us. Absolutely. So I will say before we even get started, um, I was turned on to Evoke by a friend and had no idea the connection between Wild Bliss and you guys actually did a family photo shoot for us uh, about a year ago, yes. a Christmas uh, photo shoot of my entire family. And the, the pictures just are fantastic. We love them. Thank so you. We, we love them so much. We booked another one, just my immediate family coming in April. So love thanks, it. thanks again to you guys for that. Yeah. Yes. Absolutely. So, all right, well, let's dive in. Tell me a little bit about you guys, um, how you got started in photography, when you started Wild Bliss, as well as when you opened Evoke Noco. Awesome. Yes. Yeah. So um, it's kind of been a, a long, long process. Um, I go way back into photography. I was a yearbook nerd, was doing photography all throughout high school. Definitely was just a passion um, then. And then after high school, I tried to just dabble in it part time. Um, I'll be completely honest, my business background was not uh, super strong at the time. Okay. Um, so I kind of was like, eh, maybe this isn't for me. Um, However, Candace, uh, you know, she she does come from more of a business. Yeah, background. I went to school for business, um, and then I feel like it was just kind of over one evening. We were actually in my kitchen, and it's like still that vivid like memory that we have of like I feel like you were yeah kind of just dropping out of it because you were like meh, and then I was like, what if like we just really give it everything we've got, bring do it together, yeah, you know, and the business background, photography, and then you know, kind of both learning each other's strengths and sure. combining it and it it yes. took off faster it's than we've been a power yeah. team ever since yeah so. that's amazing and you need that you know everybody has their strengths mm -hmm. regardless of what it is yeah and some people just have that natural tendency to be able to do it all but nine times out of ten i think you need somebody who does great photography and i think you do the photography yeah we both well. yeah, yeah we both do pretty much everything now in different, you know, in different little aspects. Uh -huh. um, but we both kind of taught each yeah. other both after a while. Yeah. Um, so and I, I don't think we mentioned we are sisters, so we know yeah. each other's, you know. Personalities. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Is it know, is. I think, um, you know, I personally don't think that I would want to work with my siblings. <laughs> um, but not that I don't love them. I just, again, no personalities. Yeah. But if yeah. you can work together mm -hmm. and you already have such a strong bond i mean i think it just makes you thrive so much quicker yeah it has the potential to yeah it does yeah i mean we, when we take pictures and like pose our clients together i mean i feel like she's already in my brain you know if i i see a piece of hair she's already you know 10 <laughs> steps ahead of me fixing yeah. it and um i feel like we have such a groove now that it's just so fluid and seamless and just yeah. awesome. This is our seventh year full time. So yeah. we have quite the flow now, For you sure. know, and it's like when we try, you know, yeah, when we have new ideas, I feel like they come together really quickly because we're like, we know what's worked and what doesn't. Yeah. So it, yeah, it's been, it's been great every yeah, year. Last good. year was so crazy busy. i um, excited to kind of see how, how it, it is. is. <laughs> yeah. But it's also hard to, um, you know, look to that next step of like, yeah, do we need to bring more people on our team and stuff like that? But we're, we're loving the, yeah. Yeah. The busy season and taking this time when we're a little bit slower to look forward to, you know, when that nicer weather comes around again. For so sure. no, I love it. So, okay. So that, you know, seven years, you said mm -hmm. for wild bliss in general, what about this beautiful space? Um, so this space we took over in May of this past year. Um, it did not look like this <laughs> when we first got it. Um, it was actually a print shop before this. Okay. So going to be honest, it was pretty grimy. We put a lot, a lot of hard work into it and officially started having some people in here trickle in about September. Um, but yeah, it yep. was quite the adventure. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm sure you'd notice when you pulled up, like from the front, we look kind of small, but you turn the corner, you know, from our office. And so this is the space that we do, um, community networking. Um, we've had all different kinds of events and rentals in this space. And then, um, I know that you were going to scan the rest of the building after this. And then we have our whole photo studio, 
um, in the back of this building. People do shoot in here as well, um, but the back has all the good natural light. That prime yeah. light back there. Yeah, like, <laughs> and you're right. I mean, you drive by and you're like, oh, it's a, it's a small space, but this is it a keeps big going. shotgun area. <laughs> yeah. So actually, that's a good transition. Would you mind giving me a little walk around? Yeah, let's yeah. do it. Yeah. Can't be sleeping, keep on waking Without the woman next to me Guilt is burning, inside I'm hurting This ain't a feeling I can keep So blame it on the night Don't blame it on me Right, so we're back. So, you know, we kind of touched on what, what uses are, are um, you know, currently being used for the space. So, but what types of photography do you guys do outside of the space or is there anything that you really specialize in? Yes. So we've been um, really, when we signed this lease, we knew that it's nice to um, be able to bring families inside when there's inclement weather. Um, but we're really, really trying to promote the branding photography aspect. Um, um, again, like realtors, um, anything, anybody that has a personal brand, um, good photography is, you need that in your business For these sure. days. So Yeah, such a strong feature to yeah. have. And just being able to connect with other business owners, um, it's such a good feeling. It is. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I like it. And then, so you've been in here since May, open since September. How are you liking the location so far? Is the, What's your favorite part of the area? You've got a great proximity to downtown. Are there any negatives that you found? Or Yeah, I, I personally love it. Um, when we were originally looking for a space, um, we were looking a lot in Old Town, um, which would have been great as well, but it turns out like once we found this space um, in the summer, you know, it's definitely walkable. Mm -hmm. We get this kind of quieter environment though. Um, you know, we can have a lot more people park because we don't have to worry about the two hour parking. Mm -hmm. um, so it's been really helpful for events, not having to kind of worry about all the hustle and bustle and just making it a little easier, but still having that access super close to downtown. So, yeah. Yeah. No, I yeah. think that's important. and and. The parking brought up a good point. So there's no like restrictions there's, on like no. residential parking or whatever. Yeah. yeah. And we noticed just it's such a, a plus to be able to have, you know, even just a few spots that we have with when we do these branding shoots and somebody is like, oh, I have my 20 outfits. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like you're not lugging them through Old Town. So it's, yeah, it's so nice. It's right there. Accessible. But it's not yeah. Yeah, in downtown. So, yeah. yeah. No, I think, I think it's a great location. So. Um, you know, we talked about the variations of events that you do. Is there anything happening soon that you would like people to know about? Anything that you're doing or any like promos that you're doing or anything like that? So that's kind of still in the works into this new year. We did a lot of stuff last fall in the holiday season and stuff like that. Um, we are working with quite a few business owners to get some um, yeah, networking events on the schedule for this spring, letting people just kind of get into their new year groove. Um, but keep an eye out because there's going to be all different kinds of networking events happening here. Um, yeah, and I do just want to touch on one other thing that we kind of have in the works. Um, like I said, we want to be like accessible and easy for business owners. So we're going to start having... Um, we're not sure exactly on the time frame, but like maybe once or twice a month where we just have these kind of like open house styles where you can come and get your headshots done. Yeah. Um, you know, we'll have some drinks, alcoholic, non-alcoholic, where they can kind of just come in, um, do their headshot and leave kind of thing. So definitely really great for, you know, businesses that just need that one headshot mm -hmm. or they're, they're getting new employees and they want them all to match. Um, so doing kind of those yeah. events we're, we're really pumped about. Teams can just come in together and then all their headshots are going to match, but it's almost like you can mingle while that one person is getting their headshot done and in here we'll have snacks and all this stuff. So we've got the wheels turning yeah. about how this is all going to work, but we're excited to I, introduce I some new stuff. Yeah. I think that's smart and yeah. making it more of an event style thing. Mm -hmm. Which that to be just, fun. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Rather than, you know, a tedious thing that people have to fit into their schedule. It's mm -hmm. like, oh, okay, let's do, do this thing. Yeah. And at the same time, we're banging out something that I've been wanting to do for exactly. 15 years. <laughs> yeah. Very, very old it doesn't even look like yeah. me. Yeah. 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 yeah, come as you please yeah. style. So, yeah, um, yeah kind of looking forward to that for sure. That's great. Yeah. I love it. So to help look out for things like that, tell everybody where they can find you, <laughs> of course physically, but you know, online to be able to keep up with things that are happening. Yep, so definitely social media. <laughs> yeah. 
obviously with yeah. most people these days social media is great email um, yeah um so our websites we do have the wildblissphotography.com website and evokenoco.com once you're on one of those they do tie together pretty seamlessly you'll see kind of what's happening you know here if it's specific to the studio um and stuff like that so i mean we keep up on our website um both cool. websites of what's going on and then obviously you know i found you guys on evoke noco instagram you have a Great. wild bliss instagram we, as well or we do okay yeah right. and i'm pretty sure each is tagged on each other's so perfect yeah nice and easy yes yeah, social media is unavoidable at this point <laughs> i for so many years said i don't want that and I, don't I know this and i have my facebook and i'm good <laughs> and now i'm in real estate and i've got Facebook business, Facebook, uh -huh. Instagram, TikTok. Oh, I yes, I do, you have to. But you just, you've got to yeah, do it. And that's where we're going. Yes. And it surprised me um, how good of a business platform yeah. TikTok can be. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So awesome, guys. Well, thanks again to both of you. Thank you to all of you for tuning in um, to learn about yet another great local business here in Fort Collins. So I know from experience, like I mentioned, how beautiful their pictures turn out. This space is gorgeous and it looks like it's multi use. So go ahead. Come check them out. Hit them up for your next photo shoot. I, again, am Morgan Merriman, Realtor at Remax Alliance. I uh, appreciate you tuning in to another episode of this. If you have a business or know of somebody who has a business who would like to be featured on uh, my interview series, go ahead and reach out to me. All of my information will be at the end of the video. And of course, if you have any real estate needs, I'm always happy to help out you and your referred loved ones. So thanks again. Thanks Thank again. you. Yeah, thank so you so much. much. Really appreciate it. Time.